this tutorial, we're going to show you the bare minimum code you'll need to start programming in Energia, the setup and loop functions. For this example, we just need the launchpad. The code itself won't return or control the launchpad. It's just to set up the basic structure you need to get started. Now, let's open up Energia. Setup is used to initialize variables, pin modes, start using libraries, etc. The setup function runs one time at each power up and reset. Next, let's look at the loop function, which does exactly what it says. Loops this part of your code continuously. Code that is written in the loop section of your Energia sketch will control the launchpad. One last piece that's important for any Energia sketch are comments. Comments are initialized by two slashes before any written line. Any line of code that starts with two slashes will not be read by the compiler. Commenting your code is extremely helpful in explaining how your program works both for you and anyone you share your code with. That's it. Now you know how to set up an Energia sketch and begin writing your own code to do some really cool things with the MSP430 launchpad.